What's happening? What's happening? Chilling, chilling. Um, it wasn't really being around the coaches for me. It was around being, you know, the best around being around some of the best talent. You know, and it's just showing that I could compete with those guys as well. So it was a pretty good experience, man. It was fun, you know. Say again. Oh, I'm waiting for pro day to do everything. So, uh, informal. Uh, just wanted to get some information. <laughs> Nothing too serious. For sure, because um, I haven't really even scratched the surface with my pass rush, you know. A lot of the times I just be out there bull rushing, just walking guys back. So I feel like once I get that right coaching, you know, it's the sky's the limit. Uh, I'm just learning how to, you know, use these hockey sticks I got right here. So <laughs> learning how to just where to put them at, you know, what to do in certain situations. So. No, sir. When, when was that decision made and what went into it? Um, I just been I've been rehabbing my uh, knee tendonitis, so I didn't really have a lot of time to prepare for the drills. So I'm just waiting to pro day. March nineteenth. Uh -huh. I mean, right now it's just my baby. You know, I got a baby girl that I got to provide for. You know, so. Just never want her to grow up how I went, how I grew up, those type of situations. So, what teams? Um, I lost count honestly. Um, probably over twenty-five, probably maybe thirty. I don't know. <laughs> Eden, Eden Amara. Uh. Just being an overall, you know, a stronger player, you know, um, learning how to really strike guys a lot. Um, just getting my hands on people, controlling guys, them type of things. What do you think you showed in the Georgia victory? Mm, just that, you know, I can play with anybody in the country, pretty much. How did South Carolina help you get where you're at today? For one, the coaching staff, you know, Coach Muschamp and uh, all the rest of the coaches, man, they, they never left me, you know. I, to hang out, they never left me out to dry, you know. If I ever had a problem, you know, I could always talk to any coach, you know, and just um, the group of guys also, you know, my teammates, you know, they all believed in me sometimes when I didn't believe in myself, so. I mean, I'm pretty sure, you know, people know, people know the story now, you know, just being homeless, those type of situations, being put in a lot of tough situations, seeing a lot of things kids shouldn't see, um, doing a lot of things kids shouldn't have to do. Uh, like, give you an example, like my first time um, traveling by myself, I was like 11, 12 years old. I rode the Greyhound from Washington, D.C. to South Carolina, like by myself. So, um, but I thought it was cool though, honestly. Just riding it, just seeing different things, you know. But turning point, just getting to college, just having somewhere, you know, that I knew that I wasn't gonna like get put out of, or you know, just having free meals, those type of things. Like I always tell people, like I didn't go to junior college for football, really. I just went because. I had somewhere to sleep. Like I had some free food to eat. That's really why I went. So I didn't really go with the expectation like, man, I'm gonna go I'm gonna go to the SEC. Like I'm gonna go to the league. I just went because I had somewhere to sleep, you know. So 
So I'm just going to put my face in your chin and take you down through there pretty much. So. Sir? Oh, it means a lot, man. You know, God is good. There is a God, man, for sure. You know, a lot of situations I was put in, I shouldn't even be here in front of you right now. So uh, it's a big it's a big blessing for me. Uh, I don't, I take it serious. I never take it for granted being here. Uh, like I said, I'm just soaking it all in, man. Just looking around the room, just like, man, I'm really here. Like, I've been through so much to get to this point. So I'm just, I'm loving it, man. I'm, I love being here. And Dominican Sue, um, sure, the the violence he plays with, you know, he plays the game very violently, you know, so not sparing a soul out there, man, for sure.